Hi, I'm Lawrence Juber, and welcome to LJ's Guitaristics, Rhythm Guitar. In 40 plus years of being a studio musician, recording artist, concert performer, I've played with some of the world's great rhythm sections. And I've learned that rhythm guitar is really at the heart of so much music making because it involves the groove, the pulse, it involves harmony, rhythm, articulation, dynamics, so many musical values that it really is core to the experience of music making on the guitar. And I'm happy to have the opportunity to share some of that information with you. I've organized the course into two sections. In the first section, we're gonna look at 16 key concepts, what I call my rhythm method. And we're gonna look at rhythm and harmony, chord selection, chord voicings, inversions, left hand, right hand technique, left hand choking, right hand muting, and various kinds of articulation, putting it all together so that the groove sits in a really solid pocket and that you have the technique to be able to support the musicians that you're playing with and to fill the role of a strong rhythm guitar player. In the second section, I've prepared six rhythm guitar studies, etudes, for you that cover a variety of different styles and incorporate all the techniques that we study in the first section. In the first study, we're going to look at a straight eighth note pop feel and we're going to explore when to push the beat, when to keep it even, where to put the accents in, and how to mark the structure of the song. In the second study, we're going to explore a rock ballad groove and develop from eighth notes to sixteenths, and then build to a climax. In the third study, we're going to explore broken sixteenths notes in the context of a funk groove on electric guitar. For the fourth study, we'll be back on acoustic guitar and explore the pocket of a country waltz. For the fifth study, we'll be back on electric guitar and grooving on a deep shuffle. For our final study, we'll stick with electric guitar and explore a straight eighth note rock feel. For each of the etudes, I will perform them first to a rhythm track that I've prepared and then break them down for you. And I've included a lead guitar part in each one so you have a real world context. All of the key examples in the course are tabbed and notated, plus you get the tracks to work with on your own. So picks at the ready, grab your acoustic or your electric guitar, and let's get started. <laughs> 